Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are doing a lip swatch video, which I'm really excited about because I haven't done one in a little minute. I always say I'm really excited. I need to get something new that I say. <laughs> but I am excited because this is a new collection. It's for the Makeup Revolution Matte Bomb Liquid Lipsticks. And I believe there's 12 shades and I have all of them here. I got them in PR. I'm gonna swatch them all on my lips and we're gonna see how each shade looks. It's a creamy, matte formula long wearing and all of that so we're gonna see how each shade looks on my skin tone so let's get started okay so the first shade I'm gonna swatch is called nude charm and it's described as a stunning soft brown so let's try oh they smell good they smell like like a caramel macchiato or something like that but this is intense this definitely would need a lip liner for sure so it's described as a soft brown but I would say it's more of a pale nude on me so that's this shade this is nude charm I don't know if I would recommend this shade if we're similar skin tones but you could make it work with a lip pencil or something like that but yeah on its own it's a little bit striking now if that's your thing then go right ahead like you know do your thing but yeah this is a pale nude on me so anyway next shade this next one is nude allure and it's a gorgeous soft nude is the description so we are going to try it out this one looks like it's going to be a little light as well yes yeah, definitely pretty light so this is nude allure <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking so normal as if these colors are not like yeah, but they are like intense so this is nude allure definitely not my cup of tea but I thought I'd swatch it anyway you guys know I always swatch it even if it looks a little intense so yeah nude allure so this next one is delicate brown and it's described as a versatile and easily wearable chocolate brown <laughs> it's a long description but let's try it out thinking I'm gonna like this one one. Oh yeah. It comes on like a little bit muted, like a muted chocolate, but I definitely could work with this shade with a lip liner a lot easier than the first two shades. So this is Delicate Brown. It honestly looks, I feel like a little darker in the tube than it is on the lips, but it's definitely lip colors change depending on your skin tone, so I think it has to do with that. But yeah, so this is Delicate Brown. Okay, this one, <laughs> I thought the first two were intense, but this one is really intense as well this is coral cheer which is described as a gorgeous coral pink <laughs> <laughs> this color is a little frightening but this is coral cheer and yeah it's just a really bright coral lip color so this next one I'm a little bit fishy on this one is called nude magnet and it's described as a perfect nude for all skin tones when brands say for all skin tones I always like squint my eyes a little bit like are you sure like are you sure about that for all skin tones <laughs> Yeah, so this is Nude Magnet, and just how I thought, this isn't what I would consider a nude for me. Like, I can make this work with a lip pencil, but it isn't like a nude that matches my skin tone or anything like that. It definitely needs some help, that's for sure. So this is Nude Magnet. Definitely not a bad shade at all. I just always like give a little side eye when brands say for all skin tones. So this shade is Fancy Pink, and it's a stunning bold pink and on me it's more so just like a mauvey pink yeah this is fancy pink this next one is clueless fuchsia and it's a vibrant medium mauve shade so this is clueless fuchsia I actually like how these liquid lipsticks are not super heavy they're more lightweight but they have full coverage they're not the lightest of lightweights that I've tried but they are pretty lightweight when it comes to to like how heavy it feels on the lips. So I thought I'd just point that out. But yeah, this is Clueless Fuchsia and I definitely do think it's more of a mauve pink. So I don't know how this lip color got out of order, but this one is Pink Bunny and it's described as a beautiful pale pink. It definitely is a pale pink. I probably wouldn't get much wear out of this one, but you know, I'll swatch it anyway. <laughs> it's definitely super, super intense and a little out of my comfort zone, but yeah, this is Pink Bunny. Funny. So now we're getting into the lip colors that are more my cup of tea. <laughs> we have the next shade is Burgundy Star, which is described as a beautiful.
beautiful burgundy plum you guys know i like more of deeper shades when it comes to these lip swatch videos oh yeah i knew i was coming up on it now this color is one that i definitely think that if we're similar skin tones you can wear this without a lip liner i would still wear a lip liner but you know so yes this is burgundy star we got a red lipstick <laughs> You guys know I love the reds and all of the collections that I swatched. This next one is called Lure Red and it's described as a striking and sultry bright red lip. I love it. Oh yeah. So this is more of like a red orange color. I don't know what is coming up on camera, but in person it's more red orange, which is beautiful. Oh yeah. I'm going to get some wear out of this one. I love it. It's so pretty. I can see this with even the look that I have today, which is just like light on the eyes and just lashes i think this lip would be perfect with it so yeah this is lure red this one is getting me so giddy and ready for fall i love fall and this one it just reminds me everything about fall and it's satin chocolate and it's described as a head turning deep reddish brown i like that description it's definitely a head turning lip color it's so pretty and i can definitely see the red in this one and it's such a beautiful rich color and i love it i love 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 it so this one is satin chocolate and next we have deep wine which is such a deep i would say a cool tone purple shade and it's really really pretty i definitely could see myself wearing this as well in the fall time so yeah this is deep wine so that is the end of this lip swatch video i put back on the shade lore red you guys know i love the red so i put back on that shade and i applied a little bit of mac night moth lip pencil just because i always wear night moth with my reds but yes thank you guys so so much for watching make sure that if you want to check out any of these liquid lipsticks that you check the description box for the link and yeah make sure that you subscribe before you leave and i promise i'll see you guys next time bye guys